Hello everyone, back again. Um, let me start the stopwatch again so I can know where to stop the fucking video. Anyway, I unfortunately... God damn. Didn't think you were since it's on easy mode. Oh. It's not on easy mode! What the fuck you talking about? Hang on. Alright, so... What the hell? I said it for brisk jog. But anyway, this, uh, this book just explains that you're supposed to grab four masks to unlock some puzzle, which I'll show in a second. Yep, it says I'm on easy. Chris, easy. Great. Okay, so I'm guessing the other one is beginner mode. Anyway, okay, so I didn't show that off. These masks right here, you are supposed to, or indentations, you're supposed to get four masks, put them in there, and then it unlocks that coffin thing over yonder that was over my head to where I got the book. But as my friend just reminded me, or as I just told him, um, my original intentions for this run was to do a knife run to unlock the trophy for it. And then I went into easy mode as Chris because that's originally what I was going to do. I wasn't going to go into, like, I mean, not easy, beginner mode, like the easiest mode that there was for Chris, at least. Even though playing on Chris's mode is kind of a pain in the ass. Okay, I've got the mansion key. Everything I need so far. So, what happened with that was, number one, I just got too lazy. Number two, I didn't want to do it. I realized that, um, at this point, I am still not fully used to the game. Like, I used to be a whiz at this fucking game. I ended up unlocking, like all the uh, extra hidden weapons oh shit I didn't know it did it that soon I was gonna make a joke and say no dogs are gonna break through here but no they don't Capcom trolls you because in the original they will jump through the window the first time you come through here they do it at some other specific time when you run through this hallway but you can like, I'm probably going to most likely completely avoid this hallway afterwards. Or try to, at least. Keeping my fingers crossed on try to. Because these two hallways right here are just... They, they become a pain later. They become an ammo-wasting pain, and you can completely avoid them anyway. But no, I just, I might do a knife run play in the future, but just not now. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> Especially during Chris's mode, because shit like this happens. Number one. In Chris's mode, you had to pick up old keys, and also in his mode, um, well, alright, in Jill's mode, when that zombie comes out, which you can just even completely avoid that bathroom in Jill's mode, but in hers, the zombie falls down and just steps on its head, and like Chris who just stands there and stares at it.
Oh look, nice doggies. Hi doggy. I did not hit her. I didn't. I did not. Oh hi Mark. Uh, hope somebody gets that reference. All right, so we're just gonna continue right now. They saw why rot her. Oh hi there. I love how the door just politely shuts behind him on its own. Oh. You know. Oh, here's another thing I uh I learned in my last. Oh, actually, I'm not gonna do it right now. But there was something that scared the shit out of me in my last Let's Play in that hallway. How should I do this? Oh yeah, just run straight forward. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Don't be a douche muffin. Oh god. God damn it. I don't like wasting bullets in this game. He's already fucking dead. I'm disappointed. What the fuck? Alright. Six minutes in. Six and a half, actually. Alright, so... Look at that. Never touching that again. Well, there's one point where I need to use a knife. Um... That. Why didn't I grab any ribbon? I'm retarded. Alright. But yeah, another thing I didn't explain. Chris needs to use all these stupid fucking old keys. And Jill does not. Jill can just lockpick anything. Wait. Fucking ink ribbon. Yeah, that's the, uh, Chris mode I kind of, like, tested to see what it was like. But anyway, I had just, I guess, kind of a plan. Like, I had everything planned out for what I was going to do for the knife run mode. And I just set it off for so long that... As of right now, I just don't want to go through the pain in the ass of it. Alright. God, fucking. You just gotta be on the right stupid ass pixel for it. But yes, in this game, if anybody didn't know, you have to burn the zombie. I will show you why later. Either that or you- Oh! Damn. Last let's play, I did a joke with this guy, because he wasn't- He didn't pay any fucking mind with me until I was right next to him. And even then, he still just stood there like a retard. Get the- Oh. 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 Well, I probably could have gotten- Another trophy right there. Get out of the way, Chris. Thank you. Alright. That's taken care of. Yep, nothing, as of right now. What I really need to do is go into a couple rooms, grab a couple more things, and then I'll be in the save room, if I remember correctly. 
Hopefully I can get there within the next five minutes. Let's Play is going to be a pain in my fucking ass because the PS4 can't do a full 60 minute video without cutting everything off and not alerting me of it. That would have been nice if it would have been, if it would have said in the middle of the video, hey, you might want to stop it now, it is cutting off your video. Or anything along those lines so I didn't have to go through this shit again. Take the handgun ammo. There should be one more, there should be a fucking memo down here. Actually, I don't think there's anything else here that I even need. Just get to the save room. Let's Play should just be titled Unlocking Goddamn Doors. Nothing else has really happened. Okay, so... Not falling for that shit again. I pretty much ran into a zombie's arms the last time I played this. I wasn't happy. As usually, he's standing right where I was at. So I thought, oh, well, he must still be over there. He's, like, in the northern, most northern corner. Oh, here's another reason why um, knife mode would be pain in the ass. This room would have been one of the worst fucking rooms of all time. Is this the you know, happy looking motherfucker right here, for one? Oh, sweet! That's gonna save me some trouble. Um, yeah, that's a good move to do. I'm gonna avoid him for right now, but I need to go that way later. Um, shit! Come on. Are you serious? Why is the bullet count in this game so goddamn random? Took that guy, what, three shots to get down? Oh, we don't need to burn that guy or blow his head off. And I could set the length of the videos to 30, but just anymore, I don't trust fucking Sony's recording thing. It, it literally pissed me off that I spent so long trying to record one, like, a first part of a Let's Play, and it's like, well, we're gonna just cut that short for you. Alright, so I'm gonna save it here, and, uh, that would be part two of the Let's Play. Disappointing, I know, there's not much going on. Loading screen, save successful, thank you. You can go now. Alright, everybody. So, that's pretty much it for that video. Uh, you all have a wonderful fucking day. Gonna sit here and play with the not-tank controls. <laughs>